Despite their beauty and abundance of marine life, the shores of Monterey Bay have a problem. According to a 2006 study by the U.S. Geological Survey, the bay has the highest average long-term erosion rates in all of California, eroding nearly 0.6 meters, or about 2 feet, each year. While natural factors, such as wind and high tides, play a role in this high rate, several studies attribute 50 to 75 percent of ongoing erosion rates in southern Monterey Bay to a little-known source, the Lapis Luster Sand Mine in Marina. Currently owned by CMEX, one of the world's largest aggregate suppliers, the mine extracts nearly 200,000 cubic yards of sand each year. The sand is extracted using a pond near the shore from which a dredge hydraulically mines the sand and transports it to a processing plant a few hundred yards away. The dredge pond is naturally replenished by waves from winter storm events which carry new sand into the pond. The waves also help out their business by keeping smaller grains in the bay and pushing the larger grains, which are more commercially valuable, into the dredge pond. Studies claim CMEX is increasing erosion rates by taking sand straight from the littoral system, which transports sand throughout the bay and replenishes the shores. CMEX claims their operations do not affect the littoral system. After all competing sand mines were closed in 1988, the Lapis Mine increased its operations to match those of all others combined. A 2006 study by Professor Ed Thornton at the Naval Postgraduate School showed that while the closure of these other mines decreased erosion in some areas, the Marina State Beach, located near the Lapis Mine, increased erosion by 470% around 1990. Shoreline erosion poses a number of problems for the local wildlife like the endangered snowy plover, which nests right on the beach. CMEX said they partner with a number of wildlife organizations to preserve these shoreline habitats. The economy will also be affected, said a 2012 study by the Monterey Institute of International Studies. The study estimated that erosion attributed to the mine annually costs over a million dollars at the very least. The CMEX mine has been under investigation since 2009 by the California Coastal Commission under the claim that it did not have the proper permitting to increase its mining operations. While many would like to see the mine shut down, CMEX says they have no plans on changing their operations or moving to a new location. This is Will Houston for the California Petri Dish.